What's going on everyone? I'm Nathan Mixon with MixonFitness.com. If you haven't subscribed to my channel, make sure you do so. Turn on your push notifications and also hit that like button. In this video, I'm gonna talk to you about the sauna and the great benefits of the sauna, but I also, I wanna touch up on some rules that I think, I think everyone skips because no one talks about the things that you should not do in the sauna. They tell you about all the good things, but never the bad. So with that being said, sounds are great right they help clear your skin you know it helps detoxify your system you know by help you sweat a lot all the toxins that you get from outside in the house wherever you are it's pushing all that stuff out every time i come out of sauna my skin feels clean and clear and more vibrant for that matter going to a sauna on a daily basis can also help you lose weight so if weight loss is your thing just think of it more like a moderate workout where you kind of walking uphill now results may vary from person to person you're not gonna lose like hundreds of thousands of pounds off this thing but it can definitely help speed up your heart rate in the process now if you had a long run or a very intense workout a sauna can definitely help you relax if you're tired of having sore muscles this can help reduce inflammation in your muscles helping you recover just a tad bit faster than you would if you didn't have the sauna at hand me myself i always go to a sauna after a great workout because it helps push out all the toxins like i said also help reduce the inflammation of my muscles especially in my legs and my joints and it, feel, it makes the shower it makes the shower feel all that much better now listen up i want to tell you about the things that you should not be doing in the sauna for one don't go in there naked now, i don't know if the ladies do this but i know the fellas do this for sure don't come into the sauna butt naked you should you should have a towel all right if you don't have a towel don't talk to me all right don't talk to anybody you're supposed to be relatively quiet in the sauna nobody want to talk to you with sweat running down your lips and then the lip sweat just coming off your face into my face because the sauna is, is not that big it's just a just a box right so you don't have much room to talk you don't have much room to speak so just be quiet and just bring a towel you know nobody want to sit on your your ass sweat and for my next tip, do not lay down in the sauna. It's only so big, as I stated before. Well, at least at my gym. You're leaving your sweaty back all over the freaking sauna. No one wants to sit down in your sweat, and no one wants to stand up and look all awkward either. So at the same time, be courteous. You know, sit up straight. Make sure you have a towel under you, because you don't want your skin touching that. You, if you're laying down there, and you see this guy right here with his balls and ass sweat all over the sauna bench do you really want to lay your back into that who i mean you don't really bring utensils to wash your back well i don't i use like a towel but my arms they're not getting back there all right so i'm, I'm pretty sure you have someone else's ass on your back all right so i know you're trying to get a great workout in and maybe your your session is not over with but don't work out in the sauna if you pass out in there because it's too hot, you don't know your own strength, you're gonna pass out and nobody wants to touch a greasy, sweaty body. Nobody wants to do that. Do us all a favor and just sit there and chill. You know, this is the chill zone, relax zone. You're supposed to relax in the sauna, okay? Let us all relax, just chill out. There's plenty of gym out there for you, okay? Plenty of gym out there for everybody. Keep that in mind. Lastly, don't eat a lot of food before you close the sauna in. Definitely don't eat food in the sauna because you're eating everyone else's ass. You know, ass sweat is floating all over the place. All right, so you pretty much cutting people's ass and then put it in your mouth. Everything is floating, okay? So keep your mouth shut. Don't eat in there and definitely don't get gassy. If you think you're gonna have some kind of bowel movements, just leave, because it's already a hot box, all right? So if anything you do in there, if you funky, it's gonna be funky in the sauna. So make sure you wash up before you come in there. All right, just do us all a favor. This is the thing that people don't talk about. And I want, I want you guys to know that because some people don't know the rules, the underlining rules, all right? If you have something, some kind of gripe or some kind of complaint, make sure you listen down in the description box below because I don't see everything. I'm only in the sign for about 15 minutes and then I'm out the door. So that being said, I hope you guys enjoyed the video. Make sure you get ready for next week. We're gonna have some crazy workouts for you. And I hope you like what I put out there for you. If so, subscribe to the channel. Turn on your push notifications. And I'll catch you in the next one. Peace.